how to change the currency in your Techmatics account. What's up techies? I'm Sarah Cordina. There are a number of different ways that you can edit the currency that's in your account, but the primary way, the default setting is actually controlled inside your main company settings address. So this is the address that your business is actually registered under with your Techmatics account. So on your main Techmatics account, if you click on settings, this will take you to your business information. So you have here your business profile. Now the address area, your physical address, is what will determine what your base standard default currency is on your courses, your checkouts, and your invoices that are sent from the system. And there is a way to trick the system. So just to give you guys some idea, I actually live in Australia. However, I charge in US dollars because I have a massive global um, community and US dollars is just the most recognizable in every country. Everyone can roughly translate and convert that US dollar to their own currency. That's just a process I have. What happens in your business is obviously up to you. But to do that, um, you will note here that in the street address, I've got my street address. In the city section, I've written the city and my country. And then in the um, country, I've actually selected the United States because it's the country box here that will then set your default settings. So that's how we get around that in the back end of the system here. I'm not gonna be sending you guys any mail in the post, so don't worry, all right? What, what's, what business settings you have in your address here um, is not gonna mess up any mail that you may have got from us. I'm not sending anyone snail mail, I promise. So as long as you've got your full address there, um, when you have your address, dynamic fields in the bottom of your emails and things that go out for transparency purposes. You've still got your proper address there, but in the system, it's just gonna set your currency to USD. So obviously, if you wanna be charging in Australian dollars, the country would need to say Australia. If you wanna be charging in Canadian dollars, that would need to say Canada. However, and let me however this right now, because you can in Techmatics charge in multiple accounts. It's absolutely okay for you to do, you can do that. You actually would do that inside your payments area over here. Um, now, of course, this is only gonna work if you've actually added your um, Stripe and your PayPal or authorized net accounts in here. And um, inside your product area is actually where you can create products over here and choose what currency you're charging these from. Now, wh whatever product you create in here is actually creating the product inside Stripe. So to change the currency, you first create it in here, then you go and log into your Stripe account, find that product in your Stripe account, and from your Stripe account, you can change the currency to anything you want. And from there, you can now assign this product in your checkouts um, so that you have the same product, but in multiple different currencies. So you could create multiple different landing pages, multiple different course checkouts that all connect to a different currency page. So there's lots of different options. There are even more ways that you can get creative than that, uh, but just to give you a little bit of a heads up there, that is how you can change currencies inside your account. If you've got any questions and you're inside your account, uh, the bottom right hand side of your screen is a little black and white chat box. Pop your questions in there. It's an instant chat. You should get a very fast reply. If not, please contact us on support at techmatics.com. Happy teching.